it was Nitro 91 here. I want to share something with you that I found interesting from Mr. James David Manning. Uh, to make a long story short, uh, I want to show you or tell you something about this still picture you see here. It's from one of his videos. Um, I was trying to make a, a video of it from a movie maker and I, I couldn't. Every time I clicked on this picture, uh, I had problems with my computer. I scanned the picture and uh, it had no viruses or anything in it. And uh, so I had to come up with the video method or solution. Um, what caught my eye on Mr. Manning here is that every time he came up with a video he started he starts um, sounding like Alex Jones which I don't trust Alex Jones at all I said uh, all of us truther real truther knows that Alex Jones is a hybrid is a Nephilim and Mr. James Manning here um, he was talking about Obama to, of being a Nephilim and um, you know that was one of the reasons that I started listening to this man or this entity but Satan he deceives everybody with lies and James Manning is not too far from that and uh, he uses the word of God or he claims that he's with God when he actually is a hybrid himself a Nephilim well this is what I found out from him as you can see you can see his eyes right here with a slit in the middle the other eye I don't know if you can ca I can catch it on camera but there's a slit right here as well okay Get a little closer just a little, little better right there. Now this person claimed himself to be with God and that he knows God and that God is Jesus Christ. That's what he says. This is how the Nephilim been playing with humans all along these years since the death of Jesus Christ. And in the Bible, in the Holy Scripts, of the of the Bible Jesus never mentioned that he was God he never said he was God and I asked mr. Manning to show me proof where Jesus Christ said that he was God and he just can't come up with the answer nobody can because it doesn't exist so they start coming up with all these different stories about the Trinity and all this stuff that doesn't appear in the Bible either. It doesn't show in the Bible. Um, so he claims to know God when he's a false prophet himself. All Nephilim comes from the evil. And you can see that he is a Nephilim. He's got a slit in his eye just like the rest of the blue line. Blue blood line. Like Alex Jones, um, David Icke and many other politicians out there no wonder he is always looking for a political attention instead of Christianity attention he talks more about the government and the things of, uh, of this world than he talks about of God the real God and the real God's name is Jehovah Yahweh that's why he's got a name the key of the truth of everything is the name of God, Jehovah. And Mr. Manning seems to not know that. And if he does, well, he's not telling you the truth. But the truth is, is what I have in front of me. An entity that claims to be human and to know God when he himself is a Nephilim created, a creation from the Anunnaki, a creation of the devil and Satan himself. Now, if Mr. Manning wants to debunk my story and Alex Jones, um, 
I'll challenge them to make a DNA test and make it public, make the results public, and show everybody that they are really human and not a hybrid like I claim them to be. This for me is something big because I really trusted this man just like I trusted Alex Jones before till this truth hit my face just like it's hitting you right now. So there you go people. Jesus Christ warned us about false prophets and Mr. Manning is one of one of the false prophets that he that Jesus Christ warned us about well there you have it God bless humanity God bless the earth God bless you all except for the Nephilim down with them and down with the new world order bye